Hi and welcome to Army Recognition Defense Web TV's news channel. Army Recognition explains all the weapons delivered by the United States and allies in Europe following the deployment of Russian troops along the border with Ukraine and the possibility of Ukraine's invasion by Russia. In this video, we provide an overview of each weapons and technical data. Javelin FGM-148. The Javelin system was developed and is built by a joint venture formed by Renton and Lockheed Martin. The FGM-148 Javelin is an American-made, man-portable anti-tank guided missile and employable fire-and-forget medium-range missile system. The Javelin system consists of the SCLU command launch unit and the missile. The CLU with a carry weight of 6.4 kilos incorporates a passive target acquisition and fire control unit with an integrated day at site and thermal imaging site. The Javelin missile is equipped with an high explosive anti tank warhead, which is able to penetrate armor equivalent to 600 to 800 mm explosive reactive armor. The Javelin missile system is operated by a crew of two. The Javelin missile has a fire and forgot capability, which means that the missile guidance does not require further guidance after launch, such as elimination of the target or wire guidance, and can hit its target without the launcher being in line of sight of the target. The FIM-92 Stinger is a man-portable surface-to-air missile system, also called MANPATS, that was designed and manufactured by the American defense industry. The Stinger was the successor to the Red Eye weapons system. The Stinger missile provides forward short-range air defense against low-altitude airborne targets. The Stinger missile's launch unit contains the AM-92 missile. The Stinger weapon round is shipped for the ammunition supply point in a crush-resistant hardened reusable aluminum box. It's certified for immediate firing. Stinger missile is effective against helicopters, unmanned aerial vehicles, and observation and transport aircraft. The Fire and Forget Stinger FEM-92 missile employs a passive infrared seeker to home in on its airborne target. The warhead is 3 kilo penetrating hit to kill warhead type with an impact fuse and a self destruct timer. The Stinger missile can hit targets flying of 3,500 mm and has a firing range of around 8 km. Stinger missile use passive IR UV sensors. The missile looked for the infrared light it produced by the target airplane's engine and tracked the airplane by following that light. The NLO Next Generation Light Anti-Tank Weapon, also called MBT Low or RB57, is a man portable anti-tank missile weapon system developed and manufactured by the Swedish company Saab. The NLO is a man portable fire and forget missile system consisting of an anti-tank missile stored in a 150mm caliber launcher tube built in composite material. The launcher is fitted with the gunner's optical side, a fold away launcher launch device, handles and firing mechanism, a battery package carrying straps and firing support. The missile has been optimized from the outset to combat tanks and other armored vehicles. The Enlo missile has a length of around 1 meter and has a weight of 12.5 kg. It is fitted with an armor piercing warhead that can destroy heavily protected MBT in a single shot. The effective range of the missile is from 20 to 600 meters or up to 400 meters for moving targets. It has a flight time of less than 2 seconds or to 400 meters and can be launched at 45 degrees up or down. It can be fired safely from within enclosed space such as rooms even with other soldiers present. Carl Gustav M4. The Carl Gustav M4, also called M3E1 in the US Army, is the latest generation of multi-role anti-tank weapon system in the family of Carl Gustav, developed and manufactured by the Swedish company Saab. The Carl Gustav consists of a launcher tube with a bridge-mounted Venturi recoil damper with two grips near the front, a shoulder mount and a side mounted of the left side of the weapon. The Carl Gustav M4 system is able to fire a one range of 84mm caliber ammunition, including anti-armor, anti structure, multi-role anti personnel and support rounds. The heat high explosive anti-tank ammunition can penetrate up to 400 mm of armor. The Carl Gustav ammunition has an effective range of up to 400 m against tank and 700 m against buildings and stationary targets. Some type of ammunitions have a rocket booster to extend the range to up to 1000 m. Small D. The M141 BDM Burkant Defeat Munition is US made single use anti structure rocket launcher designed to defeat hardness structures. The BDM Bunker Defeat Munition is produced by the Finnish company Nemo. The rocket is packaged in a rugged compact telescopic a disposable launcher that has all gunner controls need to aim and fire the weapon. The small D operates on the principle that the record 
created by launching the rocket is counteracted by back blast of gas fired from the rear of the weapon. This makes the small D inherently dangerous, especially in confinate umbered areas, as with all weapons of this design. The M141 has two configurations, carry mode in which the launcher is 8 and with 10 mm long and a ready to fire mode in which the launcher is extended to its foot length of 1400 mm. The rocket is equipped with a high explosive dual purpose warhead, which is effective against masonry and concrete bunkers as well as light armored vehicles. The projectile is capable of penetrating up to 200 mm of armor, 300 mm of bricks, or 2.1 m of sandbags.